Hey guys, how's it going? It is after market close and I'll be doing a, a black line TA really quick for you guys. Um, as some of you guys lost saw my last video, um, I did buy calls for black line um, like two days ago, I think, and I am up about 76% as of uh, closing time uh, for the market today. Um, it, it's going to be a really quick TA. I mean, I, I'm basing this straight um off of what happened last time on the weekly run uh on average you know for the last run after we crossed the macd on on the on the on the bullish side we did run up about 94 percent or about 45 points um we actually did um what is it called from its from its peak low to peak high we did about a 45 point increase uh, which is a 95 which is a 94 percent increase i do think we're going to be doing the same thing again, especially right now with the weekly rally from the lows. Um, we did hit it at about 76. Um, we did we did start the rally up from about 76 bucks. And I do think we're going to rally all the way up to 100, around one hundred forty seven dollars. Uh, and we're going to actually um, we're actually going to cross that uh, in January. So I am bullish on black line and might consolidate. But as of January, I do think we are on the on the road to hit. Um, uh, like around 145 to 150 dollars by by early january or so um i mean it, it, there's just too much momentum on the bullish side and support to to you know to say otherwise right so everything is bullish you know we got the month chart bullish we got the day chart bullish um on the day um we actually stayed bullish uh on the macd um we actually crossed it we actually overlapped it twice instead of falling back down on the bullish side um, we actually stayed super bullish um, on the bear side. Um, we consolidated for around three days um, and we didn't even, you know, really lose all that momentum. We lost about seven dollars on the price range for black line. And then it just kind of shot it ricocheted and it shot right back up. So you guys can see that it retested um, the, that 110 level here. Um, let's see if I can make this a little bit bigger for you guys. But, you know, we did retest that 110, uh, the 103 level. Sorry, we actually did retest the 103 level. We stayed bearish. You guys can see the, you know, the three kind of like um, uh, the three days on the on the bearish candles right there for the MACD. We actually did um, stay bearish for about three days, but um, I really don't think it's going to it's going to we're going to stay bearish on this stock at all. I do think we're going to run up all the way. I am 100 percent bullish on this stock up until one hundred and forty five dollars or so. Um, and I do think we're going to hit that sometime around January, early January or so um it like i like i said everything is just supporting it it just has way too much support on the bullish side um the fundamentals look great for the company too um so i really doubt that you know it's gonna drop you know it's gonna have like a significant drop right i really doubt that um especially looking at the month chart like it it, it had a huge huge um uh run up this month and i still and it's and it hasn't ended right so i do think we're gonna end this month maybe like around 130 or so um, and I do think Monday we're going to see another another increase. I, I expect Monday or Tuesday um, for the for black line to pop again and for us to cross the 125 and then possibly on Tuesday or Wednesday cross the 130 level. Uh, that's probably when I'll sell my options, at least one of them. And then I'll ride the other one up until December 18th, I think is when it expires. So I'll probably sell it about a week or two prior. So I'll be selling it early December or so. Um, but yeah, just a quick TA on Black Lion. I do think it's a great company. Um, I do see it going all the way up until like 145, 150 in early January. So hopefully this happens. Um, you know, I'm I'm extremely bullish. But again, if you guys want to do, uh, if you guys want to get on the, on this play, it's completely up to you guys. Do your own research. Again, like you know, I always recommend do your own DD, do your own research. Um, but as far as TA goes, everything supports it. Fundamental, like fundamental support it for it to keep going up. There's no reason for it to fall. Um, and you know, I, I want to get about, like I said, like I said, um, I want to give a shout out to my buddy on TikTok who actually recommended this ticker. I looked at the chart and I'm like, you know what, this is great. I'm going in, uh, you know, for like two options and they're actually, you know, you know, turning in a profit relatively quickly. And I'm probably going to be playing this, um, you know, playing, uh, you know, bi weeklies uh, for options on black line or so up until January. And then from there, we'll, I'll kind of see what's going on. But so far, uh, the chart's looking extremely bullish. I, there's no reason why anybody would short this right now. Um, if, if the, if um, you know, black line does turn bearish, I fully expect it to kind of consolidate instead of actually trending down. So if it starts turning bearish, like around right now, the one twenty dollar area, 
I fully expect it to stay, you know, in 120 um, for a couple of days or like a week or so before shooting back up. I don't think that it would fall dramatically to like 114 or 110, right? I do think that if if this stock turns bearish, that it's gonna consolidate and just kind of jump back and forth between a certain price range. But I don't think it'll fall. I think it'll stay flat and then just shoot right back up again. Um, but yeah, quick uh, black line TA. I'll see you guys maybe tomorrow or later today if there's any news. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.